Hello Android users, today I'd like to demo for you a little Chrome beta, the new Google Chrome browser for our Android devices. First thing you're going to want to do is go to the market. You're going to want to search Chrome beta. Once we've installed Chrome beta, next up we're going to search the Chrome to phone application. This will allow us to sync our PC to our Android device and send links. Google map directions, telephone numbers from the browser, that sort of thing. Let's have a look. Here's the same simplistic design we've come to know and love from Google Chrome with a few additional features. You can see I have multiple menus open here along the top. One of the new features is we can swipe to move in between tabs. I have to do it from the corner. And this is a little finicky. You have to be very precise to go from one tab to the other, or you'll end up going through all of them. So far, uh, performance seems pretty good. In order to use what I'm going to show you next, the Chrome to Phone application, we're going to need to log in using our Gmail account. Next, from our PC, we'll send a link, which will show up in our notification bar. Here I've linked two restaurants together, going one from the other, and the directions come up quickly and easily. We can send links from our PC quickly and easily. So far it's been running quite well. Uh, there is some glitches to note. I had a little problems with the Chrome to Phone application at first had it conk out and had to reboot. So far it's looking quite good. The pinch and pull features are... Oh, let's try loading up here. Seem to be working quite well. Uh, we still can't play YouTube videos uh, with Cyogen Mod 9, so we'll try that. Scrolling up and down web pages and everything has been quite good so far. Good user experience. Uh, I think this will, from now on, become my default. This has been a short demonstration of Chrome Beta for Android running on the HP Touchpad with Mod 9. Please like and subscribe. Thank you very much.